Hello everybody, Aqua Gear here, and welcome back to another episode of That's Too Many. Today we are going to be looking at more traps. Yes, traps. Um, those are probably the funnest things to build in Minecraft, but ignore these. Um, yeah, and guys, remember, when I do these traps, I'm not doing it for me. I'm actually doing it for you guys. I want you guys to experiment with what I'm doing and learn from it a little bit. That's really the big reason why I do this. So, hopefully, hopefully you guys get some information inspiration from this i just mumbled twice right there but anyway let's take a look at the first little trap but shh, you don't know it's a trap um really it doesn't look like a trap in any way it's just a little thing and if you want help press this button it says for complaining no shut up you're not gonna complain push button below thank you so yeah i mean you need an admin on a server blah 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 it doesn't look like a trap but hey if you press the button oh a piston what the heck oh no I'm in lava, and I'm losing all my stuff. Joy. So, yeah, this is really, actually, really simple to fix, too. So, before I do fix it, though, let's time set day, because... No, not Saturday. It's not Saturday. Let's look at the items needed. So, you need a sticky piston, one button, one repeater, like, maybe four or five pieces of redstone, all the building material you want. I am just chose a diamond block, and some signs. And I forgot one thing, which is the main part of this. You need carpets. And you could choose really any color. I'm just going to choose white. So really, the only, only re if you want to fix this trap, you just need to put signs. And just put signs all the way across. And after I do this, I'll do it again. And I'll actually show you how it works and how to build it. And you might say, oh, well, it's hard to get the carpet on there. Well, really, all you just need to step on here and just do this. Then if we go back on, press the button. It works again. Poof. And you do lose the signs and stuff, but oh well. So, um, the, how the trap works, it takes advantage of one property of signs. So let's just say we have a piston here and there's a block. So let's say if we push, uh, nah, not push, put a sign right there and we activate it. How do we act? Here, um, alright, here, I'll just do it like this. So if you see the sign, it, it breaks. So when it goes over there, it doesn't, but when it comes back, it does break. And that also works that if you have stuff attached to the signs, and even this will break, if you just put it forward like this, it'll break. And I actually got this inspiration idea from Seth Bling when he did a redstone trap on this, but I didn't want to copy him, so I just kind of went along with his idea. But anyway, all these signs are actually connected. They might not look connected, but if I press this button, they are all, all connected, and they all break. So really, that's really the main point of the trap over here so all we have back here is um the button was right there when you press this button it set signal here and through the redstone to the repeater into that piston and then that piston moved the stone block from there to there and that made the signs break and you fall into lava so really i mean i don't see why i have to build this but Really, what it's doing, hold on. I'll, I'll just kind of build like a miniature version. Really, so what it's doing is this right here. Then there's a piston over here. Then uh, I think, yeah, I don't know how to do this. I think there's a button right here. There's redstone. And it actually goes, yeah, it goes like that, a little bit like that. No, I'm doing it wrong. The actual thing looks like this. So really, this is it, right here. This is how you build it. And then you press this, it all breaks. And there you go. So that's really how you build this little trap. And I think this is actually really cool. So let's go to the more simple and useless traps, because these are really easy to uh, detect. I, I, I just lost my uh, <laughs> speech for a second. So really, this one's like, hey, this guy is like a secret base. So I want to see it. And... Obviously, you don't know you're going to die because I have a piece of wood there on purpose, so you can't see down. So when you press this button, that opens, and that opens, so you can put lava, height, and whatever. So you fall. So really what it does is when I press this button, it opens a trap door, and there's a piston with a wood block right there. So let's look how, like, what materials you need. So you just need a trap door, button, building blocks, sticky piston, redstone torch, and a little bit of redstone. So... That's how it works. You have a button back here with the rest of the torch, so it's always on. 
So, because we need this piston to always be extended, so we can't see anything. So we just put a torch there, and redstone over here. And it comes all the way over here to power this. And when you turn this off, this turns this on, and that goes in. And that's why you see the block actually disappears. And then from the same way over here, since we have the button, it'll activate this redstone. And from here, it'll open the trap door without you knowing. So really, it's just a button that opens two things at a time. And, yeah, and then you fall down. But I don't want to go down there because I am not going to the end. So really, it's pretty simple. I'll just build a little thing right here. Really, all it does is open this. And right here. Well, actually, no, not right there. Darn it. All right, well, you, you guys kind of get the point. Let me... Are you serious? These sticky pistons are always a problem. There we go. Alright, let's just say... And this... This is always extended. But, when we press this button... That will open and just kind of get some wire down here to this redstone. Let me actually try that. This is obviously not what it looks like, but I'm just telling you kind of... What it does use, so... Let's just do it like this, and I guess this is sort of how it works. Except that didn't turn on. Alright, whatever. Well, it's not exactly perfect, this little demonstration, but you guys know what I mean. Let's get rid of all these blocks, and here we come to the last one. This one's... You have to be completely stupid to fall for this one. But, real, real quick, let's get the items. All you need is redstone, another piston, blocks, lever, and torch. And obviously, you can kind of see a pattern. I love pistons and traps. So really, what this... Um, what does is obviously you won't see the rest of back here. You'd have a wall, and you say, "Oh, well, since there's a precious block here, maybe I should stand on it." And this will open this, and I can just walk through. I mean, obviously, if a person's standing right here, they won't fall in. But if someone's actually that stupid and thinks you need to stand on this block, you will fall in, and I don't want to. And then they'll think it'll open this, but you know it won't. So all this does is there's a redstone torch here. So this is always activated, so there's a block here. But when you want to open this, which it'll open by this, when you press this, really it won't open that. It'll just turn off the signal, so this comes in and you fall. This can be lava, height, and whatever. So really, this is actually super simple. Let's just imagine there was a hole here. And I don't know if I'm going to get this right, because I don't memorize a lot of these. So let's say you have something here. Oh, it's on fire. That's not good. I don't care. So really, you just gotta place a redstone torch right there. You gotta know where the piston is, too, so it's right there. Just bring the redstone over. So it's... well, hold on. So it's always extended. Actually, that was my bad, too. You gotta, I think you gotta put it like this. So when you turn it off, it goes in and on. Well, that was kind of a horrible example, but let's just kind of move it over. So I guess, well, here's the thing. I'm not building it perfect right now, but I don't really think it matters. Anyway, you guys get the idea. So when you turn it off, it's on. When you turn it on, it's off. But someone's stupid enough to stand right where it is, well, then they'll fall. And uh, my demonstrations are burning. This girl's on fire. I won't sing it. But anyway, guys, um, yeah, I hope you guys gather a little bit of inspiration from these. Try and build your own. Um, make your own video and show me because I'm actually pretty interested. I love traps, obviously. <laughs> to spend most of my time building traps and creative. But anyway, guys, thank you for watching. Make sure to leave a like and a comment as it supports my channel. And I'll see you guys later. God bless and goodbye.